No, I'm gonna catch you! Oh, you're a patch, dang it. <laughs> My pretty Pico's is full of energy as usual. Well, good for you, old man. I don't know who you are, but I'm glad you're happy. Unless that was Mr. Briny. In which case, why didn't he give me anything? I don't know, he had a name. Usually named people are important in some way. Uh, yeah. Cutting away. Oh, okay, you missed this. He just said his Pokemon are, like, staggeringly tired and innocently. Give him one of your potions? Yes. I'm a good person! What? Th thank you! Riz handed the boy a potion. I'm a good person! Thank you so much! Thanks to you, my Pokemon made a complete recovery! I know, I'm awesome. I heard a noise. Quiet. We're gonna get this. I just don't know where it is. I know I heard some screech. Oh, is that just ambient sound? Screw you then, you got me excited. Fine, I'll just take berries. I kept encountering the same kind of Pokemon, then the deck snap got better, and now I can find rare Pokemon easily. How does that work? What does that even mean? I... I'm failing to understand this one, but apparently... Oh crap, there was a special one, it's just down there, now I feel bad for sprinting. But apparently there's a Talo in one of these areas that I missed? And a Talo I think would be a pretty good Pokemon to have, considering I don't have a bird yet. And Fly becomes pretty essential in this game. So you just need to find it. Oh, there's something. There's something there. Something in the grass. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Even though it looks like it's on a worm pole. I don't want a special worm pole. But I guess we'll see what it is, you know. Maybe it's really awesome. Hey, it's a Talo! We wanted a Talo! We did! I told you. Yeah. Level 3. Bugger, I don't know if anything would knock it out. Let's try just throwing a Pokeball at it. Just throwing a Pokeball at it and hoping for the best. Best strategy? Ah, oh, I can think of right now. Fine. I'll use Scratch. Try to do the least amount of damage as possible. I feel like it's gonna die if I do, but maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, good. Okay, well, I figured I'm six levels ahead of it. That's kind of a lot. But alright. Totally fine with not killing it. I mean, that's what I was afraid of, so hey. If this means that I can catch it, awesome. You can do it! You can do it, Pokeball! Fight back! Good, okay. Ah, oh, dang it, I have to think of a nickname. Or nickname it later. Haha, <laughs> I can do that. Alright, nickname later. Hmm. Still thinking though. Let's see. Alright, Taylo! Tiny swallow Pokemon. Taylo courageously stands its ground against foes, however strong they may be. This gutsy Pokemon will remain defiant even after a loss. On the other hand, it cries loudly if it becomes hungry. <laughs> well, good for you. It's really tempted to name it Crybaby, but I'll be nice. No. I'll think of one later. I guess around the time I find the nickname Raider. There is a Wingle, though, supposedly up here. That would be nice to find, at least again for the sake of having him in my Pokedex, so I'm gonna look around a little bit. Oh, that's a trainer. Oh, sure. I'll accept your challenge. I have a lot of money. <laughs> no. No, you don't have a lot of money. Your parents have a lot of money, rich boy Winston. Well, that's probably the case, at least. Maybe he's a really successful Pokemon trainer. But given that he has a zigzag good and he's waiting on, like, Route 104 or whatever this is, I doubt that. Okay, well, um, I was actually just about to start Switch training Talo. So, I'm just gonna... Sure, why not, thing? Give both of the lower level people just a little bit more experience. Actually, I'm hoping that this will let Taylor evo er, not evolve, level up once. And it'll just give Fang some more experience, because Fang is like, right at the beginning of this level. <laughs> but it's okay, she's awesome. I hate being slower than my enemies, though. Typically, I use faster Pokemon, I guess. Oh, that did not do a lot. Hey, let's just go to Buck. We can... Buck's pretty reliable, right? It'll just ember the crap out of this zigzagoon. <laughs> there, problem solved. Oh, and Buck just barely did level up, yeah. We're in sand attack, too. So, there's that. 
and Ember! You can do it, you can do it, you can do it! Ha ha ha! Ha ha! Burn, Zigzagoon! It's actually burn too, that makes it even better. Okay, now we get to use Scratch, because I don't want to waste another Ember if I don't have to. Dang it, Winston! It's so annoying! That's that's what would happen um, whenever I'm fighting the Elite Four. I'll be like, oh, they're about to die. I'll use this weaker attack to finish them off. And then they heal. It's just stupid. Oh, well. Oh, I thought that would do you in. I guess not. That burn did more than I thought. Or the Ice Fang or something. Either way, dead now. Kind of surprised there's actually a full restore this early on in the game. But I guess it is Rich Boy Winston. Or any Rich Boy, you know. Yeah, Taylor Grid to level 4! Good! Level 5! Level 6? I didn't... I don't expect it. But nope. Okay. Cool. Why couldn't I win? I used Mama's money and everything! This Pokémon is worthless. I'm going to join the evil gang in this generation. Which, yes, is... I won't spoil it. Haha. <laughs> At long last, a Wingle appeared. Heck might not kill it. I know that it's we get the stab bonus, but Wingle's also a flying type. I'm only three levels higher than it. We're gonna try it. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Don't kill! Don't kill the Taylor! Good, thank you. Alright, now! Bag! Trying to do this without looking at my DS. Okay. Again, not because I want to use Wingle, but because I want to fill up my Pokedex a little bit more. That's why. Uh-huh. Ha <laughs> ha Thought you tricked me, Pokeball. You didn't. I knew it. Well, I had a strong feeling. Taylor getting 23. Good! Almost level 7 already. Look at you grow. And no special move I didn't see with Taylor. Maybe I just missed it. I only looked at the attacking moves, but peck. Good enough. Wingle has the habit of carrying prey and valuables in its beak and hiding them in all sorts of locations. This Pokemon rides the wings and flies as if it were skating across the sky. Well, like any bird? No. Okay. But on that note, I feel like now I should probably continue on, like, through that little foresty door. So, I'm gonna go back and heal, and then we'll head straight out. Oh. Aww. Uh, right when you were there, man. Come on, you didn't give me any time. Anyway, if you check the bottom screen, which should be, like, left corner-ish, you know. Um, there's that symbol now on my deck snap, which I assume means that I've collected every type of Pokemon available in this route. I assume. Because I don't recognize that symbol. And, it, yeah. Ooh, Petalburg Woods. Creepy. Trainer tips. Any Pokemon that appears even once in a battle is awarded experience points. To raise a weak Pokemon, put it at the top of the team list. As soon as the battle starts, switch it out. It will earn experience points without being exposed to any harm. Which I have used for Taylo so far, as you've seen. I caught a whole bunch of Pokemon! Go, go, go! My bug Pokemon team! But actually against him, being a bug trainer, and with Taylor now being level 6, almost level 7, knowing Peck, he might be able to do it on his own. Crap, was he... Was he a boy? <laughs> Taylor, are you a boy? A girl? You're a boy! Cool. Maybe Peck would be a good name for you. I could have Buck, Peck, and Feng. That almost sounded bad in my head for some reason. I think just all the sounds coming together to make some sort of cuss. Anyway. I think this is working out pretty well so far. This is definitely going to give Talo some more experience. Um, yeah, so he's going to get stronger, even though this is going to weaken him just because he's taking the brunt right now. He's taking everything. Attack plus two. Awesome. Yeah. I have faith in him. What? That got him like halfway to level eight too. No, I'm not switching. Even though I accidentally hit yes first. All right, Taylor, use pack again. I'm pointing, trying not to like get in front of my face. <laughs> Good. Ah, oh, don't slow me down. I hate being slow. Screw you. Screw you, Wormful. All right, Peck. Peck his eyes out, or at least make him unconscious. There. That's less gory. Okay. And level eight already. See this battle, this trainer has done really well for him. And plus two defense this time. Balancing it out, I see. So no, we're gonna let him finish this one off. Probably still gonna take two attacks, right? Because his attack only went up once that last time, by one point, I mean. Oh no! Good! 
Very good. I am actually kind of growing attached to the name Peck in my head. He might be named Peck. I have all these Pokemon, but I couldn't win. All these Pokemon is in you had three worms. No offense, but rethink your strength. Stay there. Stay there, buddy. Stay. Uh huh. I feel like I didn't get the right one. Stupid Silcoon. Well, okay. I don't know, I just feel like maybe I did get the right one. It didn't feel like it. Let's see if Peck will not kill you so I can catch you. It didn't! Now I can catch you. And it was a critical, too, yeah. Look at me overestimating that strength. Alright, in that case, we're going to try to. Oh, crap. How many Pokeballs do I have? One. Fantastic. So I'm probably, I'm just gonna have to kill every Pokemon I see in here. Um, yep, until I reach the next town, buy Pokeballs, and then I can come back and work on my Pokedex some more. But yeah, let me finish this up. And tell learn Quick Attack! Good for you, Peck. Oh, cutscene-ish thing. Hmm, not a one to be found. Hello, have you seen any Pokemon called Shroomish around here? I really love that Pokemon. I'm not a creeper at all. Oh no, it's a fast walking man! <gasps> he looks angry. I was going to ambush you, but you had to dawdle in Petalburg Woods. Forever, didn't you? Oh. I got sick of waiting, so here I am! You, Devon Researcher! Wait, who's talking? Hand over those papers, Kate, okay, still him. Really, you're gonna hide behind me, a kid? Alright. <laughs> you're a Pokemon trainer, aren't you? You've gotta help me, please! Forgot his voice entirely. Huh? What do you think you're doing? What, you're gonna protect him? No one who crosses Steam Magnet gets any mercy, not even a kid. Come on and battle me! Oh, that was a threatening dance move, dude. It wasn't at all. You're not threatening, I'm sorry. Especially when you send out a Poochiena after a talk like that. Now, there's anything wrong with Poochiena. I have one and I love her. I'm just throwing that out there. Alright, use Peck while I drink this water! Good job, Peck. Ow. Alright, fight back. Use Peck again. <coughs> You're doing great. I'll just shout words of encouragement to Peck and hopefully he'll do better and better. I say no problem now. I would use Quick Attack, but I'm pretty sure, yeah, I've been faster both times before. Nothing changed. And I don't know the Quick Attack would have finished him off, so, yep. Level 10. Peck is growing really fast. But, which is good, but yeah. Now you start raising Fang more. You're so strong! Riz received 360 Poke Dollars for winning, or Poke. I guess it's Poke, not Poke Dollars. My bad. <sighs> You've got some nerve meddling with Team Magma. Come on and battle me again! I was gonna say, I wish I could say that, but I'm out of Pokemon. Then, hey, we of Team Magma are also after something in Rustboro. I'll let you go for today. Alright. Good. Whew, that was awfully close. Thanks to you, he didn't rob me of these important papers. I know, I'll give you this as my thanks. Riz obtained the experience share! Okay! Cool. The experience share is a super high-tech device. I had to strain every fiber of my brain and body to develop this device. Oh, you're the developer! Kudos to you, Creeper! Turn the switch on and battle experience will be shared by all party Pokémon. Please give it a try. And with this, I'll restore your Pokémon's health. It's another technical advance that I'm proud of. Okay, cool. Very cool. Are you gonna leave? You had your Pokemon's HP restored. Ah, didn't that Team Magma? Oh, ah, no, no, Hydria. Remembering, didn't that Team Magma thug say they were after something in Rustboro too? Uh oh, it's a crisis. I can't be wasting time. All right, goodbye, researcher. I'm gonna call him Davin. Anyway, so as for this one, yes, I am going to be using Experience Share. I say that, I point that out because I know some people think that it's cheap, but hey, I see it as a good way to actually get all your Pokemon up. But first, I want to get Fang up to level 10 so that they're all level 10, getting the same amount of experience each battle, you know? I want them to go evenly, so allow me to do that. Ahaha! I did it! I snuck up on another Pokemon! Only to now realize I don't have any Pokeballs. It's okay, it was a zigzag anyway. Fang learned by level 10! 
Good. Ah, glad for that. Ice Fang was not my favorite. Oh, by the way, we're moving on now. We're moving up here. Ooh, cutscene. Uh huh. This is the Pedalberg Recon Team checking in. I'm afraid I have to begin with an apology, Ms. Courtney. It's not good news. The mission is a no-go. A little something cropped up and got in the way. Roger that. Got it. Will do. I'll continue investigating that energy we detected. Hmm. Dot dot dot. Phew. She didn't get in trouble. Or whatever. But that kid sure had some promises to train her, I'd say. So she didn't step in? Her buddy got beat. I guess they are sizing up the competition first. Um, hey look, more berries. Oh, this is probably where I get the, like, water can, huh? Cool, I'll do that now. Hello, this is a pretty petal flower shop, spreading flowers throughout the world. Your name is? Riz, that's a nice name. Riz, would you like to learn about berries? Yes, berries. Berries grow on trees that thrive only in soft soil. If you take some berries, be sure to plant one in soft soil. A planted berry will soon sprout, grow into a plant, flower beautifully, and then grow berries again. I want to see the whole wide world filled with beautiful flowers. That's my dream. Please help me, Riz. Plant berries and bring more flowers into the world. Alright, do I not get a, a pail? Select berries on your area nav and you can check the places where you planted berries. And when the berry plants sprout berries, berry symbols will be shown on the berry list on your area nav. Berry, berry, berry. So I recommend you check it often. I'm glad I actually haven't, I don't think, at least messed up talking here. Hello! Flowers will be bloom, dang it, bloom, beautifully and bear many berries if you take good care of them. You'll like tending flowers, I'm sure. You can have this! Yes, Riz obtained the Wilmer Pail, that's what I was waiting for! While berry plants are growing, water them with the Wilmer Pail. Oh, another thing. If you don't bake berries for a while, they'll drop off onto the ground, but they'll sprout again. Isn't that awesome? It's like they have the will to live. Well, good for them. Oh, you're a little kid, aren't you? That's not what I meant. Kid, talk to me. I'm trying to be like my big sisters. I'm growing flowers too. Here you go. It's for you. <gasps> I got a petra bear. Thank you, young child. You can plant a berry to grow more berries, or you can have a Pokemon hold it. But now there's a machine that mixes up different berries to make candies for Pokemon. I want some candy too. You're not a Pokemon, are you, little girl? That's right. No candy for you. Candy's only for Pokemon. Stick to that here. We gotta have our humans all fit and whatnot. Alright, so I guess I'll pick these berries, and then I want to check around the side of the house. I don't know if he's ever gonna stop watering. Do, do I... Alright, I actually have to pull away. Alright. Well, checking around the side led me to this place. I'm sneaking just cuz. I don't want to fight Pokemon yet. I don't have any Pokeballs, so it seems like a waste when I run into cool Pokemon that I would actually want. Like, I ran into a Shroomish. And it was a special Shroomish too, supposedly. I killed it in one hit, so I didn't see what moves it knew. But, yeah. So there's that. You could... Do it! Riz! Carefully! And sprint! Okay, good. Now we... Nope, not gonna do it. I'm just gonna keep moving. So with all that, <laughs> thanks for watching! I hope you enjoyed that, if you did, of course, feel free to like, comment, again for new, even subscribe. It means a lot, it really helps me out, and I would love to have you guys. So, <laughs> tune in next time for my next video. And until then, take care. Q outro, go!